Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. It's time now for the nation's sharpest opinion. Now, the thing about sexism, like corruption, is that there are no greys. You cannot come out with a haphazard excuse to defend a publicly made disgusting sexist remark about a woman and then slither away and endorse it through collective silence. Ladies and gentlemen, that's exactly what the Vadra Congress and the Vadra Gandhi family seem to be doing. For decades, the Congress party has tried to own the space of women in politics, presented and positioned themselves politically as the owners and beacons of hope for women in Indian politics just because Indira Gandhi became Prime Minister and Sonia Gandhi became Congress President. So they said, because people from the Vadra Gandhi family and women from the Vadra Gandhi family have reached certain positions because of their family name, women of India have become empowered. Ridiculous. Now, that very party is essentially shrugging its shoulders. When its own spokesperson, Supriya Srinathi, has essentially said that Kangana Ranaut's Lok Sabha ticket is a byproduct of a prevailing rate card, the reference should be lost on no one, ladies and gentlemen. The disdain for an outsider who has earned a name for herself and is ready to slug it out in a political career from the ground is not something I expect Priyanka, Vadra and Rahul Gandhi to understand because Kangana neither has the luxury of being gifted constituencies as heirlooms nor is she handed the purse strings of a political party by way of following a certain bloodline. So irrespective of the political eventually, eventually what shines through today is the Congress-led endorsement of Supriya Srinathe's comment. Viewers, the most important thing is that the Congress party is endorsing the disgusting comment of Supriya Srinathe. Not one tweet, not one statement, not even a line. Ladies and gentlemen, the same silence that they had when Sanjay Nirupam attacks Smriti Irani. You almost begin to believe the Congress party is enjoying this disgusting sexist attack on women achievers from its political opponents. So I believe, therefore, that the lack of a response single-handedly tells you of the scale of indifference in the ivory towers of that one family of the Congress. The fancy dress competition and the occasional feel-gooder venting on women's issues at press conference that only a cabal of journalists are allowed into is what the Congress party has been reduced to. And my view, my view is that the Congress party has given Kangana a head start into her political career and the Monday campaign by endorsing this disgusting and filthy comment of Supriya Srinathe through its continued silence. That is my view. What's yours? Let's debate. A day after Congress resorted to raid card slur on Kangana Ranaut, the grand old party went all out to promote Kangana's old video calling actor Urmila Matonkar a porn star. Supriya Srinath, on the other hand, was asked to lie low. Being taken against the person who hacked your account? I have written to the platforms and I don't answer arbitrary people. I don't know you, I have no idea who you are. But as a journalist, I'm only asking you that what took you so long to delete the comment? No, I didn't take any long at all. As soon as I saw it, I deleted it. For hours, the comment was, the statements was on social media handle. No, 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 not at all. As Kangana transitions from real to real life Thalaivi, she was quick to silence the opposition. Kisi bhi mahila ko apmanit karna, uske, I mean, you know, sexualize karna, aur khas kar sabse zada jo mujhe dukh hua hai, वो जो मंडी जी से छोटा काशी कहा जाता है पूरे विश्व में छोटे काशी के नाम से प्रसिद्ध है जहां पे ऋषि पराशर से लेकर ऋषि मार्कंडेय जी ने तपस्या की है उसके बारे में इतनी भद्दी टिप्पणी तो हम सब मंडी वासी जो हैं वो बहुत ही कष्ट हमें हुआ है द एक्टर्स फैमिली हैज क्वेश्चन द आइडियोलॉजी ऑफ कांग्रेस कितना गंदा और कितनी गंदी इनकी विचारधारा है और कैसी वो लेडीज है जिसने की इतनी गंदी बात कह दी एक बेटी को जो कि अभी हमारी यहाँ मंडी हिमाचल प्रदेश की जो जितना भी जनता है वो बहुत इस बात से नाराज है और कभी भी ये ऐसी टिप्पणी तो किसी भी पार्टी को महिला के प्रति बिल्कुल भी नहीं करनी चाहिए द नेशनल वुमेन्स बॉडी हैज फाइल्ड कम्प्लेन विद इलेक्शन कमीशन 
denying will not solve a problem. We have said uh, election commission because it is uh, now code of conduct. Uh, so election commission uh, is in charge of everything. We are requesting election commission to take action against both of them. While Congress top brass maintains a deafening silence, caught on back foot, several Indi leaders towed the egalitarian line. मैंने कहा मना किया हिमाचल की बेटी है हिमाचल में उनके माता पिता रहते हैं उनके पिताजी जिला मंडी में उन्हें हमने कांग्रेस कमेटी का जनरल सेक्रेटरी बनाया था तो हिमाचल की बेटी है देखिए किसी भी किसी भी महिला के बारे में इस तरीके का कमेंट करना बहुत दुर्भाग्य काबिल इतराज आफ्टर इयर्स ऑफ वॉइसिंग वुमेन्स इशूज वाई आर सोनिया एंड प्रियंका गांधी साइलेंट why the congress high command has not taken any action against its leader let's debate so the congress party has gone into a shell they're quiet about it um uh, what do you think uh sanju does this amount to an endorsement because they can also say that we are not endorsing it uh rashmi samant is on the debate renu mattal is on the debate bhavna ramanna who backs the congress actor and political analyst is on the debate my first question is to sanju does this amount to an endorsement of the disgusting comment that supriya shrinathe made you know or no uh, i've been on a couple of debates post supriya shrinath's disgusting comment and needless to add uh you know uh, there has been no apology coming from uh, supriya's end or from the congress top brass uh, and for supriya to brazenly say that it was not she but somebody from a social media team who did the needful uh, i think that is as brazen as you can get and if you notice rahul gandhi who has an opinion on just about everything under the sun priyanka vadra who was screaming ladki ho lad sakti ho during the 2022 assembly polls during hathras you know she broke police barricades uh to become the so called beacon of women empowerment i want to ask priyanka gandhi vadra i want to ask sonia gandhi i want to ask rahul gandhi who just finished a yatra saying main nafrat ke bazar mein mohabbat ki dukaan kholne aaya hu is this your version of mohabbat ki dukaan where you deride you demean you undermine the credibility of a self made woman called kangana runaut and that is being done by the chairperson of your social media team your national spokesperson supriya shrinath she said this not in her individual capacity she said this in her official capacity representing the congress and the congress party so clearly there is no apology forthcoming and as they say once is happenstance twice is coincidence third time is enemy action and for supriya shrinath the habitual repeat offender to blatantly lie i think that is as low as it can get in terms of public discourse especially one woman demeaning the other i think that is what the most unfortunate part is i i i just like to uh, you know get in renu into this debate and i request all of us to hear each other uh, you know the the sense one is getting here renu is that the vadra gandhi believes that any woman who is not from the vadra family the vadra gandhi family can be sexualized any woman who is not from the vadra gandhi family can be sexualized objective uh, uh, you know uh, undermined uh, can be attacked personally that these disgusting comments can be made to any woman who is not from the gandhi vadra family they've set a clear line of separation here because if any comment were to be made and it shouldn't be made on any woman I from the gadra gandhi think, vadra family yeah. you know they would bring the house down so i think this is so unfortunate i think particularly Absolutely. this has happened after rahul gandhi kept saying a week or so back he said aishwarya rai nachte hue dikhengi in the context of pran pratishtha so aishwarya rai nachte hue dikhengi aapko ram mandir mein and then he says congress party shakti ki virodhi hai shakti ke khilaf hai shakti ko ladenge and and k r ramesh yeah. kumar uh, a congress uh, leader said congress you? leader said the former speaker of the karnataka assembly said when rape is inevitable 
lie down and enjoy it i'm just saying these are words and we don't forget these words no no nor should we we should not uh, we should not forget words <laughs> which hurt other people politics is now gone to an all time low i think that kangana ranaut is well within her rights to contest from her home state or wherever it is she wants in the in the country uh, she wants to contest from mandi it was very clear from uh, for quite some time that that she would be brought in and that she would be a candidate and i think that she has every right to contest now that's one part of the story the second part of the story is this very unfortunate uh, controversy which has come up which uh, which uh, revolves around this congress spokesperson now she has made it very clear and she has deleted that post she has made it very clear that uh, she never did it she's saying i would never make any comments against a woman i think that we should take it take her at her word she has she has gone she's saying i'm going to find out who is the one who used my handle there were some people and i i would like to find out who has done this and then we can you know take it forward from there the point is that for every comment made good bad it's in I, did you see the did you see one minute one minute uh, reno reno whoever reno reno uh, reno reno yes. reno one, one minute I'll, reno I'll just, I'll reno i i I'll think i think in that news package we just he, ran he allow me one minute i'm just intervening you i'm just intervening right now to ask you a counter uh, yeah. in that news package we just ran yeah. we saw a reporter harsha ask a question to this congress spokesperson and let me tell you rashmi if you heard it there was not a single tone of apology there was an act of brazenness who says it's a big deal i hardly ran it who I says think, it was I there for a big hour if you more than a few hours nothing happened just, the, there just, was a no big deal finish. kind of attitude okay, i'm sorry no. i'm sorry no, no, no i no. think she's being protected here no, no, because no, no, no. okay let me I ask have, you reno let me ask you reno let me ask you reno one minute one minute one minute one minute one minute one minute i have bhavna i have bhavna ramana on the debate bhavna bhavna one minute one minute bhavna bhavna Bhavna, can I can I finish I my you. point? Arnab, you've been now that you've with the Congress Party. Like uh, let let me ask point. Bhavna a question. No 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 no. I I I, 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 I let me I'll, allow me to allow me to ask her a question. I'm coming back to you. Reno, so Reno, you'll never finish. I've got you'll never finish, Reno. She was in fourth coming on. Yeah, I one minute. Can I get her on the screen? I'm not cutting her out. One minute. सन्जू Let Sanju answer that. Thank you. Sanju, you Sanju, know, yes. Sanju, it has become your insult versus my insult. Yeah, exactly. So you that know, question Arna, is for you to defend. Dilip Bose's no, comments no, no, on Mamta Banerjee. Insult, Arna. It's everybody is. Arna, I did not heckle Reno. Reno. What is this? Reno, did I even once interject you? Can I please finish? Then you can rebut me. Thank you. No, no. Yes. Please, yes, please, you are heckling. Please. Yes. Let's yes, not. Yes, the debate please, is not about you or me. Thank you. You know, Arna. On one point, I agree with Renu. For a change, I completely disown Dilip Ghosh's statement. I think what he said was absolutely unpardonable, was uncalled for. Or जो हिंदी में कहावत है ना उड़ता तीर अपने ऊपर ले लेना. But be that as it may, what actually completely uh, is uh, something that I'm flummoxed by is the fact that I, as the national spokesperson of BJP, had no qualms. saying that yes what dilip ghosh said was wrong i have been on a zillion debates and i have said there is a 1100 page charge sheet against brij bhushan sharan singh whose name inevitably crops up on these kind of debates i have said if he is found guilty by the courts let him be hanged by the noose i am willing to say what happened with bilkis bano was wrong what i am not able to understand what i am not able to fathom what is absolutely inexplicable is the fact that the cabal which wants us to condemn brij bhushan which wants us to condemn dilip ghosh which wants us to condemn hathras and unnav 
you are the same lot that does not condemn sandesh khali you are the same lot that does not condemn shah jahan sheik you are the same lot that does not condemn digvijay singh for calling minakshi natarajan chan punch mal you are the same lot that does not condemn kamal nath for calling a dalit uh, woman imarti devi a senior leader of bjp madhya pradesh as badhiya mal so what i am against is and what i am appalled by is the hypocrisy from the other side Why is today Sagari ka ghosh quiet at what Supriya Shrinath has done? Why is today Swati Chaturvedi quiet? Why is today a YouTuber called uh, you know uh, Rohini Singh uh, quiet? This is the same cabal which basically goes berserk and you know hyperventilates. जब BJP की तरफ से इतना भी कुछ हो जाता है. This is not about your abuse versus my abuse, your allegation versus versus my allegation. But this is the same Mamta Banerjee. Let's not forget what Dilip Ghosh said. I'm not. Uh, condoning it but this is the same mamta banerjee who after the hamsa khari gang rape of 2022 said about a 14 year old young girl studying in class 9 oh was it a rape or was it a love affair gone wrong or was it that the girl was pregnant and hence she made this reckless allegation after the cbi court now it is proven that yes a tmc councillor's son was the key convict in the gang rape of a 14 year old ma'am can, can we just come back to this topic is ne condemn kiya from the other side nahi so my point is shed your hypocrisy you ask the bjp Arna, to be please, accountable can you just come back to the topic please but can you be accountable for a change can you be objective for a change can you be transparent Sanjay, for a change okay i'll let bhavna come in sanju 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 i let bhavna come in i will i will i will let bhavna come in i will let bhavna come in at this point uh Anup, I only have two questions. You know when uh, when you. Sanjay okay. Nirupam abused, abused an attack. When Miss Tangana uh, Rana Rani. has commented about Miss Urmila Matonkar during the ticket when we issued, it, it was issued for her to contest from Maharashtra in one of the constituencies from Congress I party. What was the comment that it which was come out from the Tangana Rana? Has she even asked for the apology? Has has BJP asked for an apology? Why are they even asking for the apology from the Congress I party? And all through. All through from Mr. Rahul Gandhi, Ms. Priyanka Vodra, Ms. Sonia Gandhi, ma'am, everyone. Why is it so? And you are the first one who said Congress. Me, Congress ke under election nahi hui, election nahi hui, election nahi hui. Now after the election, it is Mr. Malika Jain Kharge, sir, who was the National Congress Party president. And if at all you are supposed to be asking any question, it should be addressing to him, not to any of these family people, because they don't hold any such position to be answerable to you and your questions. So basically, because Kangana Ranaut said something about Urmila Matondkar, that gave Supriya Shrinath the license to abuse Kangana Ranaut. Really? Is that what you're saying? I'm not justifying that. I'm not even justifying no, I'm not that. No, I'm justifying that. Who wants an apology? Has she asked for 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 an One thing is one uh, uh, Bhavna, 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 Bhavna. I uh, one minute, one minute, one. Minute. What is what is what is apparent to me, Bhavna and Sanju, Bhavna and Sanju. What is apparent to me? What is what is what is apparent to me? What is apparent to me? Uh, can I just say one thing? I think that the attack on Kangana is deeply personal. 
and allow exactly. me to complete my point here please ladies you see i i believe there is something unique about the attack on kangana the attack on kangana is not a normal attack the silence on the attack on kangana is also not normal i think the dislike <laughs> and the hatred towards kangana ranaut is very very strong and bhavna you need to understand this because you being an actor you should understand that if you have seen the career of kangana ranaut from the age of 17 for 20 years and the career she has made as a self made woman having produced and directed some of the most remarkable films and you know you should know being from the uh, cinema fraternity that it is not easy to create cinema, produce no yeah well, I, well, I allow me uh, allow me to complete i am not drawing a comparison to you i am not i don't know why you are getting irritated when i am talking about kangana's achievements And no what i'm saying is what i'm saying to you is what i'm saying to you is so 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 bhavna 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 you let me complete my point you'll understand the entirety of my argument what i'm what i'm arguing here tonight and i'm i'm sure you can hear me and you want to listen to me on this point and i'm i'm making a point to you that somewhere i feel please allow me bhavna please allow me bhavna let's take a moment let's calm down let us understand that i have also observed the public response to kangana from various individuals whether politicians or others i have observed it and one thing has come out to very very clearly to me that there is a deep dislike among very strong and powerful quarters towards kangana ranaut you know when her house was broken down and when the shivasena put out in a headline saying ukhad diya the entire bollywood brigade was quiet it was as if they were happy that kangana ranaut through 20 years of trying to make something of herself and achieve something produce and direct films like mani karnika which are remarkable because she does, does not follow a certain pseudo secular line happening? now see you get stay, you know the moment i start praising kangana <laughs> renu starts getting irritated why should why should people like renu or bhavna accomplished women in their own right get so angry when i praise kangana which means at some point of time there is a deep personal dislike of kangana now how dare she stand up how dare she not want to get co-opted by us how is she done better than all of us how is she stood apart from the bollywood brigade and yet made a mark for herself how dare she have a certain political life how dare she have a career in politics how dare she be an outspoken woman let's teach her a lesson let's Teach her a lesson. How great she is! How noble she is! You how she has suffered! Oh my dear! Oh my God! Friends. You are getting you irritated. I am saying. All I am saying is Renu and Bhavna. Renu and Bhavna. Renu and Bhavna. Renu and Bhavna. You are running this program, and that you are way you are doing Arti to Kangana. But what is this? Let's call. Let's call a spade a spade. Yeah, what if you look at the look at the history of Kangana? He has bad mouth everybody in the industry. How many friends does she really have? Apart from some uh, uh, very important political people, what about the rest of them? She she takes on everybody, so it's okay. Uh, you're not friends with Karan Johar. You yeah, because you are not co-opted by Karan Johar, so you should be. How dare you not be friends with Karan Johar and yet be successful in life? No, no, no. Karan Johar is Karan Johar. I mean, this is crazy. You you have to understand the country is changing. The world where she lives. No, I'm not saying that. I'm saying it's I'm okay. Saying, she has a right I'm to contest that. elections. So and you know what, Bhavna and Renu, Bhavna and Renu, Bhavna and Renu. I want you both. I want you both. Please, Bhavna and Renu, don't get so irritated. I because I'll continue to praise her for a bit because I'm enjoying to see your reaction. No, no, no. I'm enjoying your reaction. When I'm saying that Bhavna as an actor should realize the achievements of Kangana Ranaut. Yeah, I'm not doing. Really, I like people. Really no, Renu, can you be quiet? I, I like people generally. No, 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 no. One, one, one. I, who, I, 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 I like people. I anybody. like people who come from she come from nothing and make something anyone. remarkable but of themselves through the hard work. I identify with such people. Yes, I appreciate yes, such people. Good for I think, her. I think, I, I, I. There's something to something something to really look up to. Oh, I'm sorry. A life but doesn't that doesn't give you a license to say what is a red card. It doesn't go in one that doesn't exactly. give you the license to call a, a someone who carries a red card. That doesn't allow you to, to decide the whole world for whatever. They, everybody is struggling. Everybody is trying to make a life for themselves. Is she the only one?
just because she is a great favorite of the BJP leadership. Oh, okay. I'll, let, I'll let Rashmi respond. I'm getting drawn into this her. debate, but okay, I'll get anything. I'll get Rashmi to respond. Yeah. Yeah. Rashmi is well, not spoken yet. Rashmi, come in, Rashmi, I think, Rashmi, Rashmi. I, 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 I completely disagree with you when you say that you know everybody has Rashmi their own and, struggles. Rashmi I don't think Rahul Bhandi. Gandhi and Priyanka Vadra struggled a little much. Uh, or anything compared to what, uh, you know, regular women struggle in life. Their, <laughs> their, privilege, their privilege blinds them from the hardships faced by everyday women, especially, you know, sex workers. Oh. And that's why the comment is even more demeaning because they think it is something that can be belittled. Something that you know that that's that women go it's through like in this a, country. It's like a it's something that they used to what, what feel it. The BJP's, uh, I think that out itself as, as shows the kind the of privilege. And this has been the leadership for the of next Congress last three, is sort of you know? encased in. That this being said, I think another 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 point, please. I can you please can you please the can you please. Can you please we pause for a second election. and let me complete? Let's discuss Can election issues. Can you please complete? Is Can you please let me complete? I did not hear you. Are going on I'm just making another point. And how great she is. The main oh my difference God. here is that the Congress leadership yeah, in the point. past couple of weeks has made demeaning comments about yeah. women. Why get into uh, leadership? A woman Congress, a congresswoman, happens, the, a former congresswoman, Aditi Singh, and say why MLA MLA made a comment? Why, why, why doesn't Prime Minister Modi make a comment on? Renu, let her speak. No, Renu, 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 Renu. Now, 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 Renu. This is not right. Rashmi did not say a word when you were speaking. You listen to her. No, no. You let her finish because this. I don't want this. Please, thank you. Only about that. Let her speak. Congress, Punjab. What is this obsession? Yeah, what is going shows on? The kind of attitude that said, top Congress it. leadership has. Rahul Gandhi, when he called, uh, when he belittled Aishwarya Rai Bachchan, and Priyanka Wadra, when he asked the husband uh, of Aditi Singh to assassinate her character in order to secure a Congress ticket in Punjab. So this shows the kind of you know attitude that the top leadership in Congress has. So I would not blame Supriya Shinead to be making these comments because it's a trickle down effect. When your leaders are making these kinds of comments, of course, the cadre is going to assume that it's OK to make these kind of comments against women. And then, you know, the entire thing about respecting women goes out Bhavna, for a Bhavna, toss because Bhavna. it's the leaders who are setting the example. Bhavna. It is Rahul Bhavna, Gandhi Bhavna, and Bhavna, Priyanka Bhavna. Vatra who are setting example to right. start. The rest is very okay, okay, Bhavna, Bhavna, please on that. Follow. And Bhavna. that is very concerning. Bhavna, Bhavna. Bhavna. Let, me, let me ask you one minute, one minute, one minute. One minute, one minute, one minute. Bhavna, Bhavna, Bhavna. One minute, one minute. Bhavna, Bhavna. objectional comments against women. A question to you. A question to you. On this burning subject, because 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 there is a there is you see I'll tell you one thing, Bhavna, that politicians think everybody is below them, and sometimes they bite off more than they can chew. I genuinely believe that politicians are only following another career, like there are journalists, no, like there are true. computer scientists, that's not true at all. Eh? like there are even researchers. That allow me, allow me to, allow not, me to complete, allow, allow me to complete. We have as people and citizen of this nation. Oh, so so I, I'll, 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 It is a bigger okay, responsibility. Okay, no, one, I'm holding a responsibility Bhavna, of Bhavna, all the people. Can I get, can I, Bhavna, can I complete my point? Bhavna, I believe politicians, okay, here's my belief. So far, politicians have had a mistaken belief, right? That they are more important than everybody else. Slowly as India becomes a developed country, we will realize that politicians are just another profession, nothing special. Okay, nothing special. This whole Lalbatti no, culture, every they do going, hold the power. things are we changing 15, 20 power. years from now. We you really join politics. Give them the power no, it will have to. No, 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 no they power. Power. No, 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 no. Don't, don't it's have this illusion. Don't have this illusion. No, no, one minute, one minute. One minute, Bhavna, Bhavna. Bhavna, listen, Bhavna. Bhavna, you are new to politics. Let me tell you. You give power, but you only <laughs> expect accountability, which means. If a similar comment was to be made in any country, you keep talking about Western democracies, no, your leader keeps going to America and UK saying, why don't you save India? Then please ask if a, such a comment was to be made by a leader of the Labour Party or the Conservative Party in the UK, they'd be down in the dumps by now, not getting your party's support like Supriya Shinate is getting. Okay, here's my question to you, a very sharp one. If Supriya Shinate had used the picture of a woman leader of significance from the Congress party, 
and made that comment. Simple question tonight. I want to know, Sanju. Why uh, don't you do that? Bhav, my I don't think to she is that is very dumb. Simple. If instead of Kangana, if if I I am asking you, I am asking you a question. Just think about it. If instead of a picture yeah, of Kangana, do that. there would she, be a picture. I don't think she is so dumb. She is there would be a picture. Allow me to complete. Let let people hear my question. Bhavna, Bhavna, see, Bhavna, 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 see, listen. The reason why my questions are liked as well as why they hurt is because they make a lot of sense. <laughs> and my question is, let's not go obtuse no, on this. Worry. If I'm there was a picture to of a top leader of Congress party, a woman, a woman leader of the Congress party, if there would have been a picture of a woman leader of the Congress party with the comment below, kya bhao chal raha hai? Rate card kya hai? What action would have been taken if instead of Kangana Ranaut's picture, there would have been a picture of any senior woman Congress leader? What what fate would Supriya Shunet have then faced? No, that apart. I'm not here to comment on that, or I'm not here to support Ms. Why Shuna, that apart? Supriya How is the Shuna? answer to my question that apart? I'm only here to ask that you not a apart. question. That not if apart. Was, that not apart. commentable. If you are here passing a comment on this particular. Um, Action of Ms. Supriya Shunate, what, whatever you are calling it as, why can't Ms. Kangana Ranaut go, go back and ask for an apology? So as the BJP party. Arnav, can I please come in? Okay, you know, Arnav, I have one point to make. You made a very interesting point about how the reaction of the Congress party would have been absolutely glaringly different if the same comment would have been made by Supriya Shinate, but not for Kangana Ranaut or from the BJP, but for somebody from her own group, from her own ecosystem. No, they don't do that. I'll tell you something. So I did not interrupt you. I did not interrupt you. Please keep quiet. They have the right. They have okay, the fine. Right. You continue they talking. The After you're done, I will speak. Face life. They don't After do you're that. After you're done, I will speak. Are you done? Because I did not heckle you. After you're done, I will speak. Now that you're done, let me come in. Arna, do you remember that there was a girl called Ankita Datta? She was the uh, head of the Youth Congress Division of Congress in Assam. She made a complaint against B. Srinivas, again another youth leader from the Congress party and one of Rahul Gandhi's very close confidants. Ankita Datta simply said that I have been sexually harassed by B. Srinivas on umpteen occasions. I demand that the top brass of the Congress party, it should order an inquiry into B. Srinivas. She did not even say that B. Srinivas ko party se nikal diya jaye ya barkhas kar diya jaye. I imagine, I was appalled. Instead of taking action against B. Srinivas, che saalo ta Ankita Datta has been suspended from even the primary membership of the Congress party aur ye wahi party hai jiski Priyanka Vadra har ghar ja kar har rooftop se chilla chilla kar kehti hai लड़की हो लड़ सकती हो लड़की हो लड़ सकती हो लड़की हो लड़ सकती हो अरे आप लड़की हो लड़ सकती हो तो अर्चना गौतम व्हेन शी वाज थ्रैश्ड आउटसाइड द कांग्रेस ऑफिस आपके मुंह में दही क्यों जम गया नाउ आई हैव टू क्वेश्चन दत्ता के मामले में आपके मुंह में दही क्यों जम गया सुप्रिया श्रीले वाज अ व्यूज कमेंट्स अबाउट मिस संजू शी इज आस्किंग अ काउंटर संजू भावना अस अ काउंटर आई अलाउ इट Bhavna is asking a counter to you, counter to counter from Bhavna. Bhavna is asking Sanju a counter. Go on, Bhavna. Yes, why even when I when she is saying such incidences which has taken place in Congress party, so हमारे कुछ respect ही नहीं है लड़कियों के बारे में तो फिर why are you even expecting any such answers from Priyanka Gandhi? Or I want to know now. अरे madam, if you are in public life, you will be asked uncomfortable questions. You cannot say कि नहीं आपको तो हम पर विश्वास नहीं है हम आपके सवाल का जवाब नहीं देंगे और मैं बस बात नहीं आपसे इस बात को कहने को तो नहीं चाहिए और यहाँ पर भी एक रीज़न है कि आपको तो बहुत कंफर्टेबल क्वेश्चंस हाउ शी हैज बैड माउथ क्वेश्चंस देर विल बी क्वेश्चंस नाउ दैट शी इज़ इन पब्लिक लाइफ He would That's have exactly to answer a whole lot of those questions. If somebody is in a public life, somebody yeah, like you, you have a good analyst on every show. No, no, no. I don't think you have the knowledge. 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 It's not so. It's the same person who made a comment. I am simply saying that I am not 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 saying that let priyanka vadra at least condemn and express why you so much with the law has so much to handle and you have the correct let priyanka vadra and you have to 
happening. I don't think that is happening. Whatever has been happening in this country. I still want to understand. Okay, so so I still I I will. But Bhavna, but Bhavna, but Bhavna, we we you see you see the the point the point being the the point being. There is a you whole can't, black you can't chapter say, that can be written. Okay, the the silence the silence of the Congress Party is a compounding offence. It leads one to believe that the Congress Party believes that anybody who is a threat to the Vadra Gandhi family or comes from a different family background or is a self-made person like Smriti Rani and Kangana Ranaut deserve to be the subject of disgusting comments by people like Sanjay Nirupam and Supriya Shunate. And there is a silent applause going on within ten Janpat, where they are probably has, getting a pat on their back, saying, "Well, well done. done. We are right behind." She has taken it off the handle as soon as she came. Why would anybody then go? Why should? No, no. What do you mean not done it? You do something and then say, "Don't not done it." He is looking into it. See, why? Why would the leadership step in and make an issue out of it? Rashmi, Rashmi hasn't spoken much. Rashmi, to respond to that. Rashmi, to think that Rashmi, 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 she was not in the BJP when she made that did, comment. Did, did the party now if she makes a further party. comment. Apology. Apology. to kabhi time to hota nahi hai. But she was not Aur in the party then. Now she's into politics. Man, now I think she's into politics. Okay, viewers, I, I, I think, viewers, I, 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 I will have to. This is, this is an ongoing debate. Renu Bhavna, Renu Bhavna, Renu Bhavna, Renu Bhavna, uh, Sanju and uh, Sanju and. Uh, uh, Sanju and Rashmi, this is an ongoing debate. Obviously, because it's Kangana or not, we are talking a lot about it. But also, keep